I'm Sir Tap Tap, and let's play Ossabelle. Um, the readme says here, Deep in the towering lost woods lies a forgotten town. Harmonia has sunken into its depths, seemingly lost forever. I'm guessing this is Harmonia over here. You, however, oh, are a mysterious young woman haunted by the eyes of a memory. And we shall make angels. Sending into the woods, you will risk everything to find Harmonia. So we are not Harmonia. Oh, hello! I think I will like this game! I like screwed up things. Controls, W... It's unfortunately keyboard controls, but it's a PC indie game from 2009, so... Not gonna expect gamepad controls out of that. Um, I do... Like, if you're gonna make a platforming, or like, most games that would be D-pad friendly in the year 2014 or later, Please do include D-pad controls, like gamepad controls, but yeah. We can apparently move the mouse to aim our weapon, but we don't have a weapon right now. There's quick save and quick load. Okay. Got my controls figured out. Excuse me, ma'am. Fingers are on the wrong buttons. I'm learning. You got water. Okay. I'm liking the look, look of this game. This is a horror platformer. Got some dead floating hands over there. That's good. I suppose I could have warned you that this is a, hor is a horror game, but uh, I'd rather not. Hello! Yeah, I'm gonna like this game. I love this game already, actually. Oh, I wanted to see the spooky things more. <laughs> Continue on. Got some, like, I know it's supposed to be a banner, but it looks like a giant razor blade. There's a little dead thing. It reminds me, like, games don't just have random dead splotches anymore, like Doom. Like, there'd just be random dead stuff, and you wouldn't question it. Use your eyes to open his. Oh, I see. And he just flies off. Hands! See what happens when we die. Wow. <laughs> okay then, let's not die. Guess if I should I should have expected pixely graphicness. Something in French. I guess Osabel is probably French. Too deep into the woods to the return. Forever the hearts the hunters burn. Lab door is closed. Anything open over here? No, definitely not. Presumably something somewhere else is open. I do like the ambiance this creates. I'm already liking this more than I'm scared. I'm sorry, I'm scared guy, but I was not scared. I'm liking this though. I'm like also not scared, but damn, this looks nice and has a good ambiance. I I just dig that. That's I want horror games in VR, by the way. I want awesome atmospheric stuff, not just you know stupid look. He's all red and fell. Okay, let's not get hit by that. <laughs> the door open? Yes, it is. Let's leave. I like it when the horror is in the atmosphere, and not just, oh, things jump out at you, scary! Or, you know, gore, look at the guy, he's really dead, and it's gross. Why couldn't we just be safe together? Because there's blood streaming in the horrible background. Yeah. That's probably why. The hunters smell wild blood in you. That's probably bad. Oh! That's definitely bad. These eyes I gave that you may see in the face below. Eternity. That's an awesome face, by the way. The thing with no eyes. Oh, crap. Can I... Can I Mario yo you? You can't Mario things. We're gonna need to get a gun somewhere else, then. I'm doing the spooky shit. I don't even want to... Become a sport more challenging. Sport more challenging. 
I like the horror bits more than the gameplay -y bits. Whoa, excuse me. Aha! Now we are armed. It suddenly reminds me of madness. Mostly just because our character is like white skinny person and uh, you know, omnidirectional gun pointing. The game does not tether the mouse inside of its window, so that's... Oh, you can shoot this. The game also does not show the mouse cursor. <coughs> not sure that's deliberate or not. I'm not sure why these little eye thingies are following me, but I guess I'm glad they are. But excuse me, game! See, uh, this thing! The, the, the face, the moon? face thing? I like it. Oh, awesome. Bell. I was listening to that! Crap. I'm in a save state before spooky things Wait, how, will I, how will I know when spooky things happen? Oops. Hmm. Hmm. Ha! <laughs> nice pixels there with the... Okay, so you can kill these. Angel and we, or just and we. No angel. Excuse me. Turn around! Punk. I can't, I can't read that. You've got no head. Definitely like this so far. It's a little, you know, slow paced gameplay wise, but I'm not gonna fault it for that. It's definitely more of a gamey feel than play. Aha! You done a bad thing. I'm gonna save in case scary things happen. Scary things? What are you? Oh. Uh, what the? My mouse was outside. What's happening? Ugh. That's what happens when you click outside the window, I guess. May father set the world clean. Indeed. What is that? Probably not supposed to happen. Eternal Blackness! No. Hold on, we're gonna... See what happens if that doesn't happen. Mystery Babylon, the Great Mother of... Aww, oh, that does have to happen, okay. But we missed the text, so that was worth it. Hey, Father, set the world clean. A bit of an odd way to say that, but whatever. No cursor is kind of bugging me. I'm not sure if that's a bug or intentional. Explore up. Uh, what? What? Ugh, it is way too easy to click outside the window. That's kind of a minus. Well, I have triple monitors. I guess the developer probably didn't and never noticed that you can click outside the window. It's full screen, I mean. It's not inside of a window. But if you have three monitors like I do, it's pretty easy to end up outside the window. I bet that's what happened. They just didn't have three monitors. That was interesting. I like the sounds. Especially the just spooky ambiance stuff going on. Is it ambience or ambiance? Like, it's probably supposed to be ambiance. What? I'm surely not supposed to be down here. Yeah. 
Ah. Well, don't touch that face. I like that face. Look at that. It's a good horror face thingy. Excuse me. Keyboard. Not a fan of keyboard for platformers. Stroby kind of eye hurdy. Boop. And I clicked that side of the. Ah, that's. Is it blood down here? No. Splurt. Damn it! Okay, so are we set back completely or Yes we are. I guess I shouldn't have reloaded. Not sure I'm having trouble with this. myself another save state. I'm gonna try to only save state when I think like I wanna like investigate something to make sure I don't miss something. Not sure why I decided that was the ideal point to save Because of that! That's why I thought that was the ideal point to save state. Excuse me. Also requiring another problem with the keyboard controls. Um, keyboard plus mouse. Um, making me use my second, my fuck, right hand. God damn it. Um, means that when I take my right hand off the mouse to go load state, oh hello there, hi friend, um, then I have to, you know, I have to damn it, stop mousing to, um, click and then, or to press the button, then go back to the mouse and it's a little cumbersome. So please... If you're gonna make a mouse pointy aiming game, please make sure you capture the mouse. That's what? Okay. Oh goodness. Wait, what? Is it supposed to go down faster? Oh, I was supposed to shoot it. I would not have guessed you're supposed to shoot the eternal redness of hell. Oh goodness. You're supposed to shoot the eternal redness of hell. Oh crap. I hope my red eye thingies are okay. Whee! We're not gonna survive this fall. We should not survive this fall. Whatever, we did, though. Screw the police. Parker, what are you breaking over there? Damn it! off destroying something in the distance. What are you doing? Just playing with a bag of food. You have plenty of food, Parker. It's time for spooky. Stop that. God damn, that mouse thing is annoying. Also, classic fun time. Um, if you leave focus of the window, it just acts like you're constantly pressing the last input. So, you know, if you're moving left and then you click out the window, it thinks you're just constantly running to the left. Which, again, was probably never... God damn it. Uh, I wasn't going to fault it for the gameplay, but it's a bit annoying right now, actually. Not like super hard or anything, but just kind of frustrating. Mostly the mouse thing, though. Uh, I guess this also, 2009, I guess maybe multiple monitors wasn't so common then? I don't know. Multiple monitors has always been pretty useful. Depending on what you do with your computer, of course. But that is... I might have to disable my other monitors to play this game. Why is the cursor not visible? Like, 
That would alleviate all of my problems with this. Well, almost all of them, not completely, but... Okay. I'm less sorry for using save states now. So loving the um you know, all of the horror aspects. But Oh right, you're not a hurdy thing. You're a murderer person, but satisfied. If there's any relevant French that one of you guys knows that I don't, um, definitely leave a comment if you could. I feel like we're missing a little something. Well, I'm missing a little something. Those of you who know French may not be missing something. This looks dangerous. Oh, look, like, it's a, like, evil Hydra thing. Look at the mouth! face? I don't know why I jumped. It's got like an eye there too. Excellent. I like this thing. It's my friend. I shall call him Hugo. It seems like a very dangerous place, Hugo. I'm not sure why you're hanging out here. Um. Aha. So this is a boss, I guess? Ah, that thing! I'm just gonna save every time that happens. Okay. And it's got that face in the middle, too. I like that face. It's all gross and evil. I like gross and evil things, okay? You're gonna have to deal with that. You're dead! Wait, let's see if there's anything cool over here. from the eternal face of pain or something. Whoa! Athena! No! Look at the face! Excellent. A mistake. But... But... We have no choice. But to revere you? New gun! Aw, oh, yes! Now there's some awful baddie that necessitates the use of this new gun, isn't there? Isn't there? I know your tricks, game. Can't fool me. Oh goodness. Oh double goodness, I didn't even see those. Look at his, like, freaking. he looks like one of those spiders with the, like, pointy butt things that looks like, well, it looks like that. I'm not trying to describe it. Like a big triangle. Look at him! He's cool, I like him. Respect him. He's unkillable! Excellent. That's exactly what I was hoping he was. Yep, just completely unkillable. Oh, good. No way, nothing here. Oh! You can kill him somehow. Look at that thing! I like all these gross things. If you want to please me, just make cool, gross pixel art. Oh, 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 you have to put your eye thing. Yeah! Excellent. You put an eye, your eye thing in when he's red. Okay, I for- God damn it. Not that issue, but I forgive the gameplay issues now. I try not to just constantly spam fire, but it's hard. Near my god to thee. And I have been with you since the womb. Now you're dead. Because I shot you. Poetic, in a way. In a I shot you sort of way. That was less poetic, though. 
Oh, we still have limited range with this. I see. That's the catch. Don't you groan at me? Oh god. Alright. I do appreciate the quick saves. Not many games do that on their own, like indie games anyway. I don't know what that's supposed to say. Probably just supposed to be unintelligible. Excuse me. Boop! I like how the, um, you can hear which direction something activated in. It was clearly in the left channel there. That shouldn't fall. I like these, the little, the floaty, spooky background things. I like lots of the, I like pretty much about all of the spooky stuff in this so far. Near, yeah, just near my god to the again. Oh, hey, neat! I wasn't expecting that. Damn it, I wasn't expecting that either, obviously. How far are you gonna put me back? Dang it! I wouldn't really need the, um, I guess I don't really need the checkpoint, or the quick save, but... Slightly more generous checkpointing would also make that very unnecessary. Whatever. No, it's not like it sends you super far back either. This is just the sort of game that I'm not so much, you know, playing for the gameplay. I just want to see the spooky stuff and story, maybe. Damn it. And that's something about horror games. Um, I do like there being a sort of difficulty, but it's a very difficult balance to strike. Because once I'm frustrated, I'm not scared anymore. I'm just like, uh, yeah, this is pretty dumb and annoying. I don't think this game is dumb and annoying, but that's definitely a risk. Because once you're frustrated instead of scared, it just really ruins what the horror game's supposed to be. I kind of do think it would be better to have, you know, more common checkpoints rather than save stating, because I'm tempted to save state, I'm not going to constantly save state, but it, it's sort of tempting. I will save state, like, in new areas, though. Alright, oh, I was going to see if I can kill these, the hands. You sure can't. Oh, well. I do like the Gibbs. Whatever happened to Gibbs? More games need to have Gibbs again. 90s kids remember Gibbs. Well, hello, horrible yellow dripping madness. I shot all of the hearts off of that tree. And a baby screams in the distance. Excellent. I hate babies. Activate that. Wait. Am I supposed to go back up? Because I heard it's to the left that time. Maybe it's just always to the left. Now we're definitely supposed to go to the right. Excuse my incompetence, please. Let's see what we got. Is there spooky stuff? Suffer not their turgid dreaming. Some unusual sentences here. Look at the blood tree! It's so pretty. I want a blood tree. Someone plant me a blood tree. Wait. Do we see what's down here? I'm not sure if you're new. I don't think I've been here. Yeah, you're definitely new. I never wanted to be found. Well, too bad! I found you! I'm gonna kill you, or whatever I'm gonna do. I found him in the forest. Sister? He led me to his home. Brother tried to kill him. Sorry to read these while moving. I nailed brother to the throne. That's rude of you. It's very rude. Hello! Damn it, mouse thing. Wait, what? Better be a new place. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is now. 
Mother cried tears of blood. I hate when that happens. He hung her from a tree. Aw. Then you arrived, and all my children you took away from me. Oh, hello, hands! What happens if you get touched by a hand? Nothing. Ugh, that mouse thing, seriously. Yep. Oh, you're a boss. You've got minions! I shall kill your minions. Er, perhaps not. I don't so see why that doesn't just return you to the start of the fight. This is obviously boss fight time. Am I supposed to kill those? What? I guess those bounce. No, load. Oh, you can shoot those down. Okay. Oh, whoa. That's what killed me. I didn't realize those dropped stuff. Kill you or not? If I can, you guys have a lot of health. But I guess you should take priority. Oh, yep, I can kill you. Okay. You're going down first then. Oh, wait, no, I can't. I thought I heard death sound. Yeah, I heard the death sound, but you just respawn. Well, you're buttheads. I can't respawn. But I, I mean, I guess I can actually. But, like, not the same way. It's, it's, it's rude, okay? It's rude. Shit! Not expecting reflex, like, quick reflex stuff in horror game. You, hopefully you're close to dead. It's, pattern's getting a bit annoying. Why do they sometimes not die right? I'm gonna sit over here, actually. Yep! Yeah, you scream. Punk. Cry tears of blood. Pretty little girls! You're so pretty. Pretty, pretty girls. Red tentacles pulsating in the sky. Yeah. Yeah. One by one you come. Butchering each other. Yeah, we do. We're such kidders. To be my only one. Asabel. Or Sable. Probably Sable. Designed by Amon26. Contributions by. AI slash bells. Bells. Glyph. Lullaby vocals. Sarah Littlejohn. Design advisors. Anna Anthropy. Uh, Silver Fox. Squeaker. Fuzz. Madam Luna. I recognize that name. Janie Kamara. Def. Uh, knee. Spelled funny. Peanut. The Little Spider. Built on Random Games. PF Engine. GM. Sit on 6-1. Additional FSFX, blah blah blah. So all those who followed this long and winding road, thank you. 2006, or 2009, Amon 26. Written in blood, blood for Satan. Aw, Sable. Well, that was short, but pretty cool. Just loops, I assume? Yep. I'm pretty sure I wouldn't have gotten frustrated if it weren't for the full screen thing. Um, definitely not perfectly made, but uh, the the relevant bits, like the gameplay wasn't obtrusive, the story was deliberately surreal, um, like no clear ending, but I definitely love the horror elements. Um, sound works well, music or the the visuals work really well. I love the spooky faces. I like spooky faces. 
I will give this an actual spooky out of spooky.